Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. We strongly recommend to stay on SIM as long as needed before you start using real money. Uh, we will uh, cover first uh, the signal automated trade. Right now, we it is only 12.07, the 2nd of March, Wednesday. And uh, normally, we try to get everything done uh, before 12 o'clock. And, uh, and uh, normally, if you cannot get anything done before 12 o'clock, no use to sit all day long uh, on the market. Very rare something happened in the afternoon. So uh, it's a midday, um, and uh, we will cover uh, the signal at the, to start with. Have a five different automated to trade uh, on the signal, as you see from the market analyzer. Uh, at the moment, we have 779 takes based on one contract. You don't need to trade all of it. As an example, you can trade ES, the last entry signal, not the whole day, the last entry signal is 119 ticks based on the last entry signal. On the NASDAQ, 346 ticks based on the last entry signal, not the whole day. And the YM, 209 ticks based on the last entry signal. The ES is based on one contract. The NASDAQ is based on one contract and the YM is based on one contract. So this is, uh, to start with, is the, uh, the market analyzer. And from the market analyzer, you can use one minute, you can use 15 seconds, and you're very welcome to follow us on the other channel live. We also show the 15 seconds. Uh, let's look at the uh, beginning, at the precision auto trade, most of it. Uh, hit the daily target. We still have one chart, it's uh, the 30 year treasury bond. Actually, today uh, the 30 year treasury bond uh, has been uh, very good, uh, moving very, uh, very nicely. Uh, the advantage with the 30 year treasury bond, it do not jump around like the ES, and it's a very stable movement. It's, and uh, we have a plenty uh, clients. They they trade manual, even the thirty year treasury bond, and it it is a slow movement, but uh, it's a stable, and uh, uh, gives you enough time. And like the ES, go up and down uh, because of the volume. Anyway, the the three minutes uh, on the precision auto trade. The precision auto trade take a trade with the trend and can reverse in the same time. It does not require any filters. It's one entry and it is an excellent entry and it is a very smart entry, very friendly use. Uh, it does not require a lot of knowledge. If somebody knows a little bit about Ninja Trader, can learn how to optimize this uh, auto trade within two days. Uh, ES three minutes, they all on one thousand dollar target. If the market going to your direction, the auto trade will stay. However, if you want to go more, or if you want to go the whole day, or what you have to do, right click and uh, reload, or you can set up a different uh, daily target. Whether you wanted to set it up to three hundred. 500 or a thousand or two thousand or three thousand depends on your account uh, you can set, set up the amount plus minus and then once you hit the target the auto trade stops itself so as you see here this is a, from the bottom uh, the the es3 range took that trade and nailed uh, the the 1225 uh, within minutes it was done uh, on that trade Uh, the ES two minutes, uh, uh, 2,612. And also uh, this one here is a thousand dollar target because the market was going to your direction. The auto trade is not going to stop it. And once it hit the target, as you see, 
uh, there is no more trades. So this is really brilliant. On the ES3 minutes, uh, we started a little before nine o'clock on all the auto trade, and we were done even before 10 o'clock, and it is one shot, 3,300, uh, and also this one here is a $1,000 uh, daily target because the market kept moving to your direction, so the auto trade stayed on. So this is a really something, and it is a very beautiful, easy, half an hour, and it's done. And also there is a, a huge impact on how the market moves. Once you catch this move, you're done for today. Uh, I want to go back to the 30-year Treasury bond. Uh, it is an amazing today on the 30-year Treasury bond. It took one trade, uh, no, uh, I'm sorry, it took one trade here, and it was done from one trade because we started around a little bit before nine o'clock, uh, 16.56. Uh, ES 28 second is one of my favorite scalping 1500 30 year treasury bond took one trade and it was done by 11 o'clock 1187 uh, the Russell on the six range I don't know personally trade Russell uh, but uh, the Russell we have a lot of traders use Russell uh, is 1220 and then uh, we have the ES 170 takes. Uh, I like the 170 take, and it's uh, become. It's not about the PNL. It's more about uh, hardly you see a lot of losing trades on 170 takes, as we see here: one trade, two trade, three trade, four trade. None of them lost, and that it is despite the the PNL whether it's 1400 or 400 is irrelevant it is the consistency because when there is a lot less losing trade and then we have a consistency we don't know what is the market holding for us tomorrow but i like the consistency in the uh, 170 takes also on the cl4 range as an example you can see there is hardly any losing trades one winning trade, two winning trade, uh, one losing trade, three winning, four, five, six. So we have six winning trade and one small losing trade. If you notice, we are not using a big uh, stop loss. It's a four range, it's an excellent. You don't need to use a lot. You can get away by 10 ticks of stop loss on a four range with a CL. Easily can be done and that it is management. It's very important how do we uh, use the management, um, uh, how to, um, uh, which we educate uh, every member for free. And then uh, we have the CL12 range, 1380. Uh, we have the NASDAQ 24 range, uh, 2400. Um, and then we have the 30 second ES 1350, 22nd uh, CL. <coughs> Why we use the smaller um, time frame? Because sometimes, like on Mondays, usually the markets don't move a lot, or the market is on a sideway today. Uh, most of the auto trades fell to use a smaller time frame like that. But because the precision auto trade is very accurate with the entry, most of the auto trades, if you they use 20 seconds, 30 seconds, they wind up in a disaster because the, 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 the type in entry is just based on moving averages. And that is no longer exist in 2022. That can be okay 20 years ago, but that is a way out of date. Uh, to just move and use the moving averages. Anyway, so now it is more like a smart entry algorithm, math, you know, we no longer lives in the 90s. Anyway, uh, the CL three minutes, it is 1760 and the ES three minutes, 1062. Uh, I want to jump on a different uh, type of an auto trade uh, called the TI7. 
The TI7 is a bigger auto trade. You can cut the trades uh, the way you like. The TI7 for serious traders, there is a huge variety of uh, entries and filters. And I like to show uh, you can go on a huge swing trading as we see right now. Uh, the ES on that trade and it is $7,300 uh, on that trade. And then if you are happy with it and or if you want to walk away from your computer, you just close the position as we did now. We had $200 uh, dollars losing trade before that. And um, this is what is really nice about it. The, the stop loss is very small and the swing trading is a huge. So you just closed and it is 6,850. Uh, you, um, what you do, you iron all these noises in the market if you want to do swing trading. This uh, uh, TI7, it is it's like many auto trades in one auto trades, many a different type of an entry in one auto trade. You're not obliged to one uh, entry and you have to deal with the market on one entry. With the same price we have, uh, stand getting one lousy auto trade with one entry. You have a whole toolbox with uh, uh, manual trading, auto trading, there is over 15 auto trade. Each auto trade is very unique for a different purpose. From the 30 range a trade to the 28 second on, or 38 second on the NASDAQ. You can cut the TI7 the way you want it. You can set the condition uh, to trade. You can set it up the way you want it is depend on your experience, the type of money you have. You have people, we have people have 2,000 and we have people have 250,000. Depends if you are aggressive, conservative, what is your risk? What is your reward? Depends how you want to play the game in the market. And then this TI7. <coughs> Excuse me, you can set the condition how you want it to trade. You can cut it down to two trades a day and you can go ahead and make it as aggressive as you want. So this is the NASDAQ scalping. Uh, also, all of it is on $1,000 trade. And when the market goes to your direction, it's going to stay. That's why here it's become irrelevant if your daily target was 500 or 1,000, as long as this market go into your direction, it's gonna stay uh, on, on uh, that trade. Uh, if we look at the CL8 range, one trade today, uh, 1470 based on two, con no, I'm sorry, two trades today, uh, based on two contract, 1,470, and uh, it has two trades, and what is nice about it is not the PNL. Is avoiding this area here, where most of the auto trade fell into this area here, and it is extremely accurate, confirming before it takes the trade, and two trades less headache, and consistency. He has five minutes. Scalping based on five minutes. There is a lot of traders like the ES on five minutes. And uh, we have some traders that like the 14 second, the advantage on the 14 second or 20 second. And that's why you see those out of date auto trades. They cannot trade this kind of a time frame. Uh, and you can see how consistency is there. One, two, three, four. And it's a skipping. This is the, the not the PNL, it's a skipping the flat market. And if we look even on the 14 second, this is a very flat market. On the pullback, nailed it as an entry. On the pullback, nailed it again as an entry. And this is what is really count is the accuracy of the entry 
It's not the auto trade, it's just a gloom and an indicator and call it an auto trade with a couple moving average or ATRs. This is another example and that it is a beautiful chart. It is one trade, two trade, three and four trade, 1,075 on the YM 26 second. For the ones has not much knowledge, he will be better off on the smaller time frame. The reason is some of those people are new in the trade and they cannot observe if this market trend in today or not. So this is an advantage for this guy. Cannot see the market is trending. Then when he goes on a lower time frame with an accuracy of the entry, a smart accuracy, yet it is a friendly from the outside. This is can make his life much easier. And then the rest is up to the market condition if he's going to make it or not. On the DAX, I only have one chart DAX. I don't use whatever that is called line break and rank a bar and all those banana charts, all those fake charts. We don't. I only use four minutes and I've been using it almost now for two years. And there is only one chart DAX because it is very consistent. No reason to use a different chart. And unlike a DAX for people who know me, uh, I love to trade DAX. So for me, the DAX, the four minute, it is very consistent and it is very fast. You have to be aware what's going on. My knowledge with the DAX is if you keep your eye on the ES, uh, you have milliseconds ahead of the game on the DAX, which you can predict it, which the DAX in one country and the ES in a different country, yet the ES can give you a little prediction what's going on on the DAX before it happened but you have to be very fast and you have to observe what's going on. You don't have time to sit down and trying to think about it. On the NASDAQ two minutes, scalping is 17.80. CL again, also, this is a statement, a smaller time frame, 55 second, scalping and 23.30. Scalping five minute ES seventeen twenty five ES swing trading two thousand six hundred and eighty seven. It depends how you want to play the game in the market. Thirteen range one thousand two hundred eighty. If we want to compare the thirteen range, this is a very heavy chart. This is a very serious chart. And if we look at the fifty five second uh, today, maybe the fifty five second made more money. But what I have noticed, you don't need to use a bigger stop loss and all this. What I notice when you have a good auto trade, reliable auto trade, none of those uh, rank a bar and line break and ATRs, uh, because those that will not work on the smaller time frame. But uh, this is uh, five minutes. Uh, you can see uh, that uh, can give you more advantage in your uh, daily uh, uh, market uh, on the Nasdaq five minutes scalping fourteen eighty YM five minutes fourteen sixty five and then we have the ES eight range for the range lover we have a lot of people they like to trade range range is good for getting filled on the auto trades it is fourteen sixty two ES one minute this is a statement when you have an auto trade. It does not work on one minute. You're just wasting your time. You can spend every weekend and you were never able to get it uh, to work. And that's why you see a lot of auto trade with fake numbers on the left bottom side here, uh, loading many fake days. And, and, and uh, they try to use line break or Branco or something odd. And the reason is they cannot show the one minute because they don't have consistency on the one minute. Once your auto trade can work on one minute, can work on anything because the Ninja Trader is based on minutes at the bottom of the chart. You can see it's based on minutes. And the only time 
uh, you're gonna understand what's going on in the trends when you are auto trading or when you are looking at your technical chart uh, based on one minute. Uh, the CL9 range is 2000, which you can see from the CL9 range and 55 second, the 55 uh, second did very, uh, much better. Uh, ES 4 minutes did uh, 1500, and then the e, uh, 11 range uh, on the ES, that was a beautiful trade. And it is one break even, and then took the beautiful entry exit perfect exit and we were done uh, by 10 14. i want to cover just uh, one more side um, i just want to show you the institutional uh, is uh, taking uh, right now one more trade this is a total different auto trade uh, this is the institutional auto trade uh, based on four minutes and I would like to show the scalping is a total different automated trade. I cannot cover the 15 auto trade, but I can cover some of it. Uh, um, so let's look at the uh, scalper. The scalper is a very friendly use. There is only one entry also. And uh, the advantage uh, you can use it on a CL, whatever you want. Uh, the advantage uh, also on the scalper, you don't need to use a trail and a stop if you don't want to. There is an option. You don't need to use a stop loss. You don't need to use a break even trigger. Uh, on the uh, scalper, uh, actually, uh, CL 5 range 1340. Uh, on the scalper, uh, uh, it is one entry like the precision auto trade and it is a very advanced and uh, most of those here they are on a zero training stop and a stop loss and uh, uh, we when you put it on zero it determined by itself the auto trade to close and this is we have to understand that uh, when you are auto trading you're not the only guy is auto trading there is some other people are auto trading. They are much more educated than you and they are much more advanced trader and they are using much more advanced uh, auto trade than you are. That's why we constantly uh, trying to use the latest technology because if you don't use the latest technology, uh, the right programmers, uh, the right um, um, entries and all this, uh, then you're gonna fall behind and you're gonna stay in a small circle because for every guy making a dollar somebody is losing a dollar so when a guy is much more advanced than you are and uh, and uh, you are just using moving average with lack of education knowledge your chances of surviving is zero to none uh, uh, that's why uh, if you want to buy an auto trade, make sure you're going to get educated like we do to our client. Uh, we don't hold hands 24 hours, but we at least we try to teach how to look at the technical chart when your auto trade is trading. We try to give knowledge. We don't want to uh, uh, teach price action for the 10 years, next 10 years, but uh, and knowledge because if you if you don't have knowledge how the market working today uh, then most likely you're gonna end up in trouble so um, this is a very friendly use you can put zero 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 on trailing stop stop loss and and you let the auto trade right if we look on the 30-year treasury bond 520 ticks it did automatically it took the straight one two trade and it was done, all of them are on $1,000 target. If we look on the uh, gold, and you can see sometimes there is a distance between one entry and another entry for a reason. When it is the market is in the right direction, that auto trade is gonna take the scalp and it's gonna, when the minute he sees there is an open door, it's gonna jump on it. And this is what, is, what it is, gold scalping. On the CL 435 ticks, this is an example. Uh, it is uh, six, 
1680 and you can see uh, on that trade he reversed the trade and on that trade he took with the trend on this one here he reversed the trade you know and that it is brilliant on the Nasdaq 10 range it is a very impressive uh, uh, chart if we look on the scalp and 10 range you don't get a lot of trades on the range but if you notice there is one trade break even and then stayed away took a trade and took another trade 1845 I personally like that when the auto trade does not get aggressive on every bumper in the market to take in a trade because sometimes it can burn your fingers if you're not looking at your technical chart also if we want to look at the takes on 595 there is no losing trades and it is 1150 on the five range as an example with the es took one trade two trades and it is done one thousand dollar even on the ym five minutes made three thousand six hundred fifty and it is one shot and it was done in one trade and that was brilliant on the gold six range 13 and again you can see uh, the different timing uh, between that trade and that trade and this is a scalping it's not a swing trading if you want to swing trading we have the proper tools for swing trading if you want to reverse the market we have an auto trades they only take reversal we have an auto trades a trade between the fib we have auto trade i mean there is a different purpose for everything the so trader can have all the tools he have and then he can decide which direction he want to go and this is the ym 290 is 13.85 folks that's all what we have for you today i wish you a very good day the rest of the day but we are done for today and uh, i will see you all on the other channel uh, live uh, at 10 o'clock eastern time thank you very much and god bless every one of you bye for now